Hello everyone, it's 4th of July, just in case you didn't already know, and my brother and I are going to have a contest in which we're going to build some fireworks. So, first of all, a few things. I'm going to show you my, uh, I don't know what he's doing over there. <laughs> um, I'm going to show you um, how to make fireworks, and this is going to be a fully inclusive tutorial. And if, if my editing software works properly, in the top right, I would, I would put it, should be a, um, basically a time lapse of the hour which we get for our contest. Hey Steven, how's it going? Pretty good? Alright, Steven's gonna help me out here. So, what the, the rules are for our contest is that you have to build, I have to build fi a fireworks show across this river and he has to build one across that river. We edited them in an MC edit. So, and they can be, there's pretty much no rules as long as it's past the river and you don't sabotage other people's fireworks projects. Each of us are going to have an hour and let's, let's begin the tutorial. So in order to make these fireworks balls, wait that's a firework rocket, okay. I want to make, you, you want to make the stars. Actually, you know what, let's just start out by making a firework rocket. It don't do nothing. It don't do nothing. What am I doing wrong? It don't do nothing. It don't do nothing. Okay, <laughs> I overused that. But anyway, what you have to do is you have to make a fireworks ball, a fireworks star. And it can be any color. It could be a mix of colors for all that you want. So, let's go ahead and make these into some fireworks. Now, after you make these into fireworks, allow me to point out that if you use one gunpowder, it goes up a short amount, two gunpowder, a slightly longer amount, and three gunpowder, a, a lot longer amount. And it's shapeless, so as long as they're in the crafting recipe, you're fine. So let's use our, um, our short one that mixes colors. See, look at that. That's pretty good. Ooh, that looks nice. All right, let's, let's use the long one. Dang, that goes up pretty far. Oh my gosh. Thomas went crazy. Okay. Well, let, let, let's, let's, let's keep 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 on task. Okay. Put a gunpowder in. Let's let's have a pink and green firework. Now, assume that we add a fire charge. This gives the this gives this firework star a ball shape. So let's go ahead and see what the different shapes are. Darn it! <laughs> I made a few extras. Okay. Now we'll go ahead and put one of you in. Get a creeper shaped one and then we'll get a burst shaped one okay now we have all of these all right this should, this is good we'll get our star shaped darn it <laughs> I mean okay don't shift click if don't don't do this don't shift click if you're doing if you're doing this okay now, now let's go ahead and get ourselves a large ball shape. If there's no shape, it automatically defaults to a small ball. So now let's get our, like, alright. So we'll go ahead and start out by trying our large ball shaped. Boom. Compared to the small ball shape, that's pretty big. Large. Small. So keep in mind, that's a pretty good effect you can use. Now I kind of like this one. It's star shaped. It's hard to get to work though, because you know, it's, it's really... It, it just, it just, it can be a little bit messy, but star shaped, creeper shaped. Actually, you know what? That's hard to see. Let's let's throw one creeper shape. On. Oh my gosh, Thomas is like mechanisms. He's having too much fun. What is he doing? God, he, we need to put. He's. I'm afraid he's probably gonna beat me in this contest. All right, creeper shaped. Now let's go to burst shaped. It's kind of like no specific shape, it just goes all over the place. Gosh. 
So, now we have a few more, a few more things to point out. Let's go ahead and remove our, fire, our old fireworks. Now also, the, the way we're going to make our fireworks show is we're going to shoot this, shoot them out of dispensers. Now let's go ahead and see if we, see if we can't do this. We'll make light gray and, let's say light gray and light blue. And we'll put in a fire charge, but we'll also put in a diamond. And what a diamond does is gives it a trail. If we put in a glowstone, it'll also give it a lasting trickle, twinkle effect. There's so much chaos going on right now. So as you can see, it's got a... Wait. Okay. Trail. There's the trail. And then there's a twinkle effect. something crazy, I know. So, as you can see, when we go up, there's a trail that follows it, and then the twinkle effect up there. Trail twinkle. And that that wasn't that wasn't that difficult. Despite all the distractions and every all the mobs everywhere around us, I think we successfully covered our fireworks tutorial. Now, um, I think that you the time lapse in my in the top right is completed. And I haven't even started working on it yet, so I don't know how that's gonna work. <laughs> so anyway, I hope you- oh my gosh. <laughs> so anyway, let's see if Thomas's- Thomas's name tag zombies can beat my fireworks show. <laughs> Alright, I'll cut- I'll cut until we're ready to have the final show. So welcome back, everyone. Thank you and viewers all alike. Welcome back. We have our two fireworks displays. I'm gonna I'm gonna show the minions and viewers mine. So here's what I tried to do, and it didn't work out very well. Two problems with with my design. The first design flaw is that barriers. There, I, I couldn't get a barrier. It just didn't work in some 1.7.10. Just didn't work. So anyway, um. What we tried to do is get the flying diamond to show. It kind of works, but it really doesn't. This is the bulk of the show right here, which is basically just a bunch of fireworks firing off, like, all at once. Or at least one at a time, and then one at a time again and again and again and again. And it's just a vicious cycle. So anyway, now Thomas... Oh, I, my show isn't... I don't think I did that well. I don't think I did that well. Okay, minions of yours, I don't think I did that well at all. I think that, I think I'm gonna get wrecked. I'm gonna get wrecked. All right, let's start it. Okay, minions of yours, we're back. I screwed up the torch, okay. Here we go. Oh, this is good. This is good. I like it. It's doing better. I don't think, all in all, I give, if I'm on a scale of 1 to 10, if I could rate myself in a performance score, I'd give myself, you know, maybe, maybe 5 or 6. I think this, this is pretty solid, but I don't think it's anything that special that I did. I, I did, it took an hour, and I don't think I did too well, but I, I did, it is some pretty good work. I, I, the just thing was, I spent too much time on the diamond. Alright, so 
I, I'm really interested to see what Thomas did when it comes to this type of stuff, and he's he's really creative. I didn't do that much except for a a, gen, a, a normal show. Marker. I'm really interested to see him hit what he did. I'm very interested. Ooh, this is really good. Yeah, Merc. Okay, seriously though, don't. I, I'm not. I'm not hating on you. I just said America. I mean America. It's fine. America. I, I can pronounce it like a normal person. Wow, this is really nice. This is really nice. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I was th wondering what that was, but that, that's really good. I really think that was a great show. Yeah, he's he's going to be Seth Bling one day. He gets himself fraps. He does he goes, does his art magic of two world with his with his crazy like spells that could possibly mean something sexual. <laughs> yeah, I. But anyway, I think that Thomas beat me. But if you if you have a different if if you have a different idea, put down a comment to see who won. Like the video if you enjoyed the tutorial, and subscribe and become a minion today if you enjoyed the video. <laughs> this is great. See you next time.